Hello everyone, this is Tess and welcome to my dance tutorial. I'm going to teach Hatsune Miku's Anime Naguchi. So to Hatsune Miku fans, I hope you will like this tutorial. This is a mirror tutorial, so please imitate my movements as you face me. The tutorial will be composed of two parts. The first part is the explanation and step-by-step -step tutorial, while the second part is the slow music tutorial. But before we start, please don't forget to click the subscribe button in my YouTube channel as well as the bell icon. Please also hit like if you like this tutorial. Let's start. Let's have the footwork first. Bend both of your knees first as you straighten your legs, stuck out your right foot to the right side. So as you place your right foot together with your left foot, again, bend both of your knees. And then as you straighten both of your legs, stuck out your left foot towards the left side then after that move your knees going inward and outward inward and outward okay again one two three four five six seven or instead of having a count of seven we can just have a count of end so again bend one two three four, five, six, end. Now, what about the hand movements? Just do take note that the movement of your feet is opposite with the movement of your hands. So when you're moving your right foot, it is your left hand that is moving, okay? So since you stuck out your right foot towards the right side, it is your left hand that will be moving. The movement of your left hand will be from your chest area it's going to go down like this and then move it out your body and then put it back at your chest area. And when it reaches your chest area, change it into a closed fist. After that, do the same with your right hand. And while your right hand is moving, simply drop your left hand at the side. Now, after this, left hand, closed fist, Move it up, down, up, down, like a lever, okay? So it's like this. Now, let's do it all together with the footwork, slowly, with counting. So it's going to be one and two, three, four, five, six, end. So on the end count, close fist, you're going to move your arms on a circular movement in front of you. Okay? So it's like this. So again, one, two, three, four, five, six, end. Got it? After this, you will do the same routine. But this time, since you pointed your right foot first, it is your left foot that will be pointed to the left side. So from here, do the same routine. One, two, three, four, five, six, end. One, two, three, four, five, six, end. Last set. One, two, three, four, five, six, end. Again, one, two, three, four, five, six, end. 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 And that's the chorus part. Now for the dance break, so place your right foot at the back like this. So you're going to step it backward and then your left knee is bending a little. So your position will be like this. Your left knee is a little bit pointing towards the right side. So it's like this. And then both of your hands are at the side. Both palms are facing downward. After that, you're going to move your shoulders. It's like this. 
okay? Together with your hips and your knees. So it's going to be one, two, three, four. So that's four counts. One, two, three, four. And then after that, shift. It is your right knee that is now bending. Continue moving your shoulder and then your hips like this, okay? Again, we're counting. One, two, three, four, and one, two, three. Now, after that, hand movements first. Stretch out your left arm like this. Palms are facing the audience. Sit and slide, you're saying stop. Do the same with your other arm and hand. Both of your hands are overlapping each other now. After that, move both of your hands going inward like this and then out. And then move it again inward, but it's the reverse this time, inward and out. So it's going to be tak, tak. Okay? Tan, tan. Let me face the side. Tan, tan. Okay? After that, place it at the side like this. And then rotate your wrist as you move your arms upward, making a V position. And then after that, rotate your left hand first. And then to be followed by your right hand. Okay, again, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now, what about the footwork? Uh, you're just marching as you're doing this routine. So let's start from here. One, two, three, four, and one, two, three. One, so you will step your um, left foot as well as you stretch out your left arm and then step your right foot and it will be continuous now like this and then to the side you are just continuously marching rotate rotate and you'll proceed to the next set of steps okay so again from the top one two three four and one two three four one two three four five six seven eight from here hand movements first place your hands at your shoulder so it's like this simply touch your shoulder and then close fist and it seems like you're just placing both of your fist at your shoulder level like this and then cross after that place it upward like this so right hand will be in front of you the left hand will be at the back so it's like this okay and then change position and then change position again and then open okay so from here after the, the rotation place it on your shoulder and then close fist cross and then up one two three open okay now what about the footwork as you place both of your hands on your shoulder like this step your left foot to the left side and then after that step it closer to your right foot as you place both of your fists at the shoulder level like this and then step your right foot to the right side as you cross your arms like this and then after that, in this position, step your right foot closer to your left foot. So as you're doing this, you'll just be um, changing weight. So in this position, it is your left knee that is bending. Change to your right knee, and then left knee again, and then right. So again, from the top, one, two, three, four, and one, two, three one two three four five six seven eight one two three four five six seven and from here move your hand going down like this and let them meet each other so it seems like you're going to clap after that place your right hand at your left elbow and then um, stretch out your left hand like this it seems like you're going to give something to the audience then after that place your left hand towards your right elbow so it's going to look like this now 
and it's now in front of your chest. After that, just slide your arms like this so that um, your hands will be overlapping each other and then place it above your head like this. Okay, so from here, clap and then stretch out and then close, slide and up. Okay, now what about the footwork? As you clap, step your left foot to the left side and then as you stretch out your arm like this, Put it back to its original position or drag your left foot closer to your right foot. And then, as you change the routine, change weight. So it's your right knee that is now bending. And then slide and place your hands above your head. And again, you change weight. After this, look at the right side. And then step your right foot to the right side. And then left foot to the left side. And then after that, place your left foot again closer to your right foot. And your left knee is bending a little. The other leg is straight. Put down your hands at the side. After this, point to the audience. This time you change weight. Point to the audience. And then change weight again. Emphasizing your index finger, let them roll like this three times. One, two, three. And as you do this, you're again moving your hips up and down. So point to the audience, rotate, rotate, rotate. And after this, let your hands meet like this, that, move it inward and cover your eyes. And then open. And then uh, it seems like you're waving the mission reverse wave but your hands are going outward. So one, two, three, okay? Now, while you're doing that, um, you will maintain this position of your legs and feet, and you're just continuously moving your hips up and down, up and down. So, from here, and one, two, three, back, back, open, one, two, three. So, from here, and clap, stretch out your arm, change weight, and then slide and up. Look at the right side and then point, point, and down. Okay, so let's have it from the top. One, two, three, four, and one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and from here, stretch out your arms like this. And then after that, place both of your hands at the back. So it seems like one, two. So you're just going to imagine that you've thrown something at your back and then down and then to your chest. So again, from here, stretch out your arms like this and then move it towards the back and then down and chest. Okay. What about the footwork? So from here, your left knee is the one that is bending. Simply step your left foot to the left side and then close it. Then step your right foot to the uh, right side. So together now with the hand movements from here, open, back, down, chest. Now from here, hand movements first, place your left hand at your forehead like this, palm facing towards that side, right hand, it's here at your side, palm facing downward. And then your other leg is straight while the other leg is slightly bending. So it's like this. So you're slightly facing the left side. 
from here your hand so it's like this left hand it's at your left side your palm is facing upward same thing with this one this is at the right side but its position is a bit higher with your left arm and your palm is also facing upward and this time you will also face the um, right side so it's going to be like this now and it is your left leg that is now bending a little so again from here and then here after that place your left hand at your waist right hand close fist and put it like this so it seems like you're going to hit something downward in front of you and then after that right hand place it a little near your right shoulder left hand at the side it's like this and again bend your left knee a little and while you're doing this routine um your movement must go together with a bit of the music so while you're at this position it seems like you're uh, moving your body with a bit of the music tan 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 ta tan 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 ta tan 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 ta tan 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 so again from this last position out back down chest and face the left side tan 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 ta tan 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 Tan, 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 and tak, tan, tan, tak. Now from here, hand movements first. Move your arm going to the side. So it seems like you're trying to um, reach out something at your left area. And do the same with your other hand. And while you're doing that, movement of your legs or feet will be opposite with the movements of your hands. So since you're moving your right hand move your left leg left knee will slightly bend towards the right side and do the same on the other side one two after this you'll simply change weight change weight move your arms like this it seems like you're going to um, let your arms meet at the center and then do a reverse of that position and change weight again okay so again one two three four so if you'll notice you're opening your arms like this and then close and then open again then close and then after that open your arms and then place your right arm here at your tummy area and then the other arm stretch it out like this so it seems like it's going to pass above your other arm okay so it's like this now what about the footwork as you move your hand like this your right foot will step at the side and then drag it slowly closer to your left foot so it's going to be like this tak, tak. so let's have it from here your last position and then out back down chest tak 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 and tan 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 and one two three four five six after this move your body facing now the left side and then your hand will rotate and it's it seems like it's going to touch your forehead okay so ta, ta. and look at the position of my legs it's my um, left knee that is bending a little while the other leg is straight after this put both of your hands down like this and step your left foot backward from here place both of your hands in this position look at the position of my legs and feet so it's my 
left knee that is bending and my left foot is on a tiptoe while the other leg is straight. And imagine that uh, you're squeezing something. So squeeze it three times. One, two, three. While doing that, you're going to move your hips again like this. Okay? So one, two, three. After this, drag your left foot closer to your right foot. Face the audience now. And after that, your hand movements will be like this. So it seems like you're doing a snake position with your hands and arms. So both of your hands are facing towards the right side and then reverse and then out. Okay, right, left, out. Okay, while doing that, you're just changing weight with your feet and legs. Okay, so again, one, two, out and down. From here, and squeeze, 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 and back, 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 down. And from here, hand movements first, form a right angle like this. So right arm is stretched out towards the right side while the other one is stretched out up. After that, rotate your arms like this. And then do the same on the other side. Again, one, two, three. Footwork. Step to the right side. Do the same with your left foot. Okay? So again, from here, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. One, two, three, four, and five six, seven. After that, rotate again your arms like this and stretch out both of your arms in front of you. So let your arms cross each other three times. One, two, three. And if, while doing that, you're just changing weight again. Okay? One, two, three. And then place both of your hands on your shoulder and then Tilt your body towards the left side a little. So in this case, to be able to do that, you will have to bend your right knee and then point your right foot to the right side. Tilt your body towards the right side and then open your arms like this. So uh, as you open your arms, so it's going to do a slight rotation and open. Okay, so again, tilt it to the left side point, tilt, rotate, open. And then after that, drag your right foot closer to your left foot. Let your hands meet like this. Stretch out both of your arms in front of you. And just simply um, do like this. So move your hips up and down, up and down. And then after that, open to the side. As you do this, step your right foot towards the right side and then rotate and then up and then step your right foot towards the right side and then drop both of your hands down palms facing downward stuck out your left hip like this and look at the left side and the dance break is finished so again from here one two three and back, 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 and to the side, rotate to the other side, rotate, cross, 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 and then on your shoulder, tilt to the left side, step, tilt to the right side, rotate and open, and stretch out your arm, tan, 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 and open, and rotate 